Hey, Deborah Danielson here, Deb's OG. I'm at home, and I don't know if you all are aware or not, who, all of my fans who've been watching my music career, um, I am dressed up because my new song's coming out this Friday, May 29th. It's called White Woman's Rap, and it's really kind of a song about me and celebrating that, well, I guess celebrating the fact that, you know, I finally said, screw it, I'm gonna be who I am, and I'm going to enjoy myself. And if you love it, come on, let's all celebrate together. If you hate it, well, okay, then you can just um, go on down the road. But what I am all about today is showing you kind of my costume that I have for this wrap, and then I'm gonna play the rap and we're gonna talk about the rap and what it means and how I hope you download it, stream it, have it at parties, have fun with it. But it's meant to celebrate, it's meant to have fun. And you know, kind of like that old saying, <laughs> white men can't jump. Well, there's something to that, right? But there are some white men that do jump. <laughs> And then it's kind of like white women can't rap. Well, you know, some of us do have a little rhythm and we do have a little, you know, good side to us when it comes to that. So I think this rap is fun, but I think it's a serious rap in that I've worked really hard on it. Um, I feel really good that I'm working with some guys out in LA and I love these guys. I think they're amazing. So I want to play a little bit of this for you, and then I'm actually going to try to dance, but here's the problem. When I dance and I try to do the bobo, my wig wants to fly off, so it's not good. i got to figure out how to fix that problem. Give me a couple of bobos to go. Boom. And we're gonna have some dancers and we're gonna film in July out front in the street. Oh, you didn't know? White women rap. We can hold our own. We don't cut no slap. We just set the tone. We won't hold you back. We just hold your stacks. You be like, get back. So we're gonna be doing this dance out in the street. And I hope, I hope, I hope that we can get the streets blocked off. And there's only going to be a few of us. And we're going to wear our little masks. We're going to be socially acceptable apart. And this is my mask I'll be wearing. It's this one. I love this company, Dolls Kill. Love it. I have on Dolls Kill clothing right now. I love it. I'll show it to you in a minute. Do the bubbo, do the bubbo. So the bubbo is like Muhammad Ali did the shuffle. And so we're taking the Muhammad Ali stuff. And I love Muhammad Ali when I grew up. I grew up watching him box and fight in the ring. And then I also like his lyrics. Bubba, do the bubba. Bada, bada, bada. Do the bubba, do the bubba. Bada, bada, bada. Do the bubba, do the bubba. So, that's the song. And I can't wait till it comes out on Friday, May 29th. Stream it, download it, share it, send it to friends. We did a lot of hard work on this, but now, um, because of COVID, obviously, uh, we have to take a lot of precautions. We can't normally, we can't film like we would normally do. We can't bring in our normal film crew and make a really cool music video, which I, <laughs> I have it all storyboarded out. But what we are gonna try to do is sometime in July, early part of July, is we're gonna, pro we're gonna try to block off the street out in front of my house. 
little short block. And then we are going to have a few dancers and we'll be very far apart. And we're gonna have a drone come in and film us. And we're gonna be doing our Bobo. So the Bobo, and we're gonna have a dance competition on TikTok. So I want you to really try, we're gonna have like, I, I have got a choreographer and she's also an amazing, I guess, um, I don't know, she's kind of genius how she thinks things up organically. But I wanted her to make some steps that would be number one, easy for me, but number two, doable out in the street. So my, my goal is to try to do like a mini, mini, mini Michael Jackson <laughs> in the street um, or Janet Jackson, but to do some moves that anybody could do and feel good about and have fun with. That's the whole point. Or if we ever get to go back into a club again, a club environment, let's try to do something that everybody can enjoy and have fun with, right? So um, the plan is, is to do out the dance out in the street and then I'm gonna have it broken into two separate dances for the TikTok competition. And I'm gonna show you some of the moves. So the first move is going to be the bobo part, where we're talking about do the bobo, do the bobo. And so basically, Muhammad Ali would do the shuffle. So we're gonna do the Muhammad Ali, boom, boom, left, right, left, right, we're gonna do that. And then it goes, uh, do the bobo, do the bobo, butt out, butt out, butt out. So that's gonna be like what we call our talk, our TikTok butt out, butt out, butt out. And so we're gonna click to that and then we're gonna go wiping our brow, boom, and like we're putting away our gun down to our side. So that'll be the first dance and that'll be to the chorus. The second dance, um, which is where we're gonna have um, a lot of the other dancers kind of freestyling around me, which will be kind of fun. And I, I think it'll be wonderful. Because the, the people that are going to be in this with me, there's only a few of us, obviously. It's socially acceptable kind of filming. Lots of space, only outside, so there'll be extraneous noises. But the people who are with me uh, deserve a shot to be seen. They are part of the Omaha Dance Troupe, and these these people, these people are amazing. They've won all kinds of national competitions and whatnot. They're really fun and they're really good hearted. And none of us have practiced together. None of us could get together. I'm taking these dance lessons over Zoom with my teacher, my choreographer. And, um, you know, we're kind of doing this really safe, really careful, kind of planning it out. And so when we film this, It'll be the very first time any of us have gotten together. We've never met, nothing. So, and you know, because of the COVID stuff, we're all gonna be pretty separated out. Second part of the dance will be where, we, where she starts in and she sings, elegant, sleek, nothing make. So this'll be more, you know, we're gonna have like a pose. We're gonna strike like a Vogue pose. So it'd be elegant and then we're gonna go sleek and then um, nothing meek. And then it goes working hard to preserve these cheeks. So then we're gonna spin, slap our cheek. <laughs> Not this cheek, the other cheek. So it's meant to be fun and it's meant to be kind of like laughing at ourselves but yet respecting ourselves. And so that's what this is. It's about respecting yourself. It's about paying homage and tribute to all those women who work hard every day to provide for the families. A lot of single moms, but a lot of, a lot of people that are trying to be a wife, a mother, a corporate executive, or just working hard in a packing plant. Whatever your situation, the sun celebrates anybody and everybody. So whether you're boy, girl, male, female, something in between, it doesn't matter. This song celebrates you and how you are working hard and you need to take a time out and celebrate yourself. So that's what my song's about. 
I hope you love it. I'm going to try to do the dance moves and I'm going to go through it kind of slowly so that you can see them and get ready for the TikTok. But the other thing is too, I don't know how much I can do to keep my hair, my hair on my head. <laughs> I love this wig. It is called Industrial Goth. It's amazing. But the thing is like on me like a helmet and without a chin strap, boom, it's going to ricochet right off. So you'll have to bear with me. <laughs> so now I'm going to try to shoot uh, my outfit, talk a little bit about that and try to talk a little bit about, and this is all behind the scenes for White Woman's Rap. So one day when we do get to do a music video, a real music video, we'll be able to do it the way I want to do it, which is super cool. But I'm going to um, do another cut here where I'm going to talk about my, my outfit. Okay, so I'm trying to clear out some space here so you can get a good view of me. So my costume or my outfit is by uh, a company called, and I love this company. And so they sent me a face mask, Dolls Kill. And it is to me great. So I have on a hoodie and you see the hoodie is kind of like scooped in the back, just enough to keep you warm but not, you know, you can breathe like when it's hot outside. And you can wear this with or without the chain. I love the chain. I think the chain is like super cool. Underneath here, this is a little teddy lingerie thing. And it has dragons on it and it covers up the essentials. <laughs> and then I have on some leather shorts and then some just black tights. Now, for my shoes, these shoes, I love these shoes. Hopefully you can see these shoes. Um, they are just awesome. So they are men's shoes, they're Adidas. I love them. And, uh, or no, excuse me, they're Nikes. I apologize. I have an Adidas pair too. This is a Nike shoe and I love it. The bottoms are like, big suction cups and it's really cool and you can move and dance in them you don't need dance shoes these are actually better than my dance my hip-hop dance shoes that I bought so I love these I also love that these shorts have little pockets in them and these are the shorts that I wore for Dibs OG rap when I first started out so anyway I love this outfit tell me what you think of it I hope you love it it's fun and sassy and to me, it's industrial goth classy. Now, the one part I didn't talk about is my earring. I only have one pierced ear. I'm sort of like a pirate, I like pirates. So um, I just thought this earring tied in so nice with the chain and it's just kind of like that little elegant touch. So when we talk in, in the song where it goes elegant, sleek, nothing meek, I think that's the cool part. So when that part comes in, the dance move for down, and I'll just go really slow. So it's going to start saying, so we're going to stand with our toe down. We're going to put one hand on the hip and this hand goes right here on the neck. And it's gonna be hard for me to move in here, so I'm gonna go kind of slow because I got the carpet down. So, elegant, and then sleek, like this, sleek. Nothing meek, working hard to preserve these cheeks. This right here for the geeks, stack money and Stack money and dance with the freaks. Now I have to move slow because my my wig will flip off if I don't. So <clears throat> that's how that part of the song goes. Now the bobo, just refresh your mind. Let's get the bobo up here so you can hear. Now, so 
sorry, but my hair, my wig is coming off and I had to put my head down. <laughs> but normally you wouldn't put your head down. You would keep your head up and the bobo, boom. So we're just gonna jump back and forth like that. So they're easy steps, they're fun. And then the tick for butt out, butt out, butt out is butt out, butt out, butt out, down, right? Butt out, butt out, butt out. So you're gonna do the Muhammad Ali move, boom, boom. Then you're gonna tick and go like that. Now, if you want to do, when we have our dance comp competition here, if you want to do your own moves, chore choreograph your own, I'm all about that. Sorry, I'm gonna adjust my wig. I'm all about that. Dabs OG wants to see creativity. So you go out there, you be yourself, be the spice of life, and send me those videos. When we get up on TikTok, I'm all on TikTok now, my music's there. <coughs> Excuse me. And so May 29th, we're gonna release White Women's Rap, and then we're gonna go into a dance competition, and it'll be held through TikTok. So get ready. You've had your little primer now. You've had your behind the scenes preview of white women's rap and one day soon god willing we will have a vaccine and we will be able to get together and party